Oh, my name is Charles Yang, and I work for Thermal Scientific, and I'm based in San Jose, California. And today I'm going to talk to you about the, uh, my poster here, uh, which is basically um, utilization of uh, high screening for quantitative analysis for uh, pesticide screening, food matrix, using the Xactive Plus on a bench tap or retrap platform. So here, basically, we describe what the poster is about, and what we have here is a instrumentation that basically can scan fast enough for UHPLC type work. As we go through the method here, uh, we can see that the sample prep is done by catchers, which is a uh, technique that is used a lot by uh, food safety labs right now, as well as the hardware, which is the Xactive Plus. Here you can see from the diagram the Xactive Plus where we have the S lens, and then the ion belt goes through the bent platypole, then through a transfer ion, and then into the uh, C-trap, and then into the Orbi. Uh, we have an HCD cell behind the C-trap where all the ions are fragmented and then transferred back into the C-trap and into the Orbi. Over here we have the LC conditions for the instrumentation run. Basically it is a very simple method where we screen a lot of compounds at one time. Uh, here's the gradient that shows you the basic gradient run time is about 20, 12 minutes. And then the mass spec conditions, which is very simple to use. Uh, so the scanning range is from uh, 12, uh, 120 to uh, 1,000 mass range. Uh, and then the ionization is a ESI ionization. The result basically is run in our software called TraceFinder. TraceFinder is a quantitative software where we can do quick processing and uh, routine lab workflow. In this diagram here, we basically show you the results of the run by showing you a component on the right side and then the actual sample on the left side. Down here we have a calibration curve and then the peak of uh, integrated peak that's shown here. Typically when we run through the software, we basically at the end we have a report generation. In the report generation then we showcase how well the software can produce PDF files or Excel or Word templates so that you can actually import these things into a limb system or print. In here in the generated report, you can search for a compound by typing it in the text, and it will automatically go to the, uh, the data where it is stored on the PDF. Over here on this side, we basically have a special place in data review where we can look at all the data and be able to adjust parameters here prior to printing out on their report generation. Once this is done, you basically have a quick way of reviewing everything. Down here are the mass accuracy, the 90 pesticides that we analyzed. So down here, the mass accuracy is all within uh, less than 2 ppm throughout the whole run. On this side over here, we have all the R square, which is linear calibration curves. Um, the results here basically shows that they're all within the calibrated range of 0.99 as well as the LODs, which is basically at the lower end detection limits of the compound. In conclusion, what we can show here is that the instrumentation, uh, the Xactive Plus, with the software trace finder, can detect all the analytes that you are screening for and targeting against. And for more information, you can download this at thermoscientific.com forward slash ASMS. Thank you.